Welcome back to the film room. Today, we're talking about Odell Beckham Jr. Obviously, if you watched any NFL this season, you'll know that even though OBJ did not have a great start to the season, he really picked it up, especially in the playoffs. And considering the reports that his knee surgery did not necessarily go as planned, I think it's especially impressive. I think he showed in the final couple games of the season that he's still a guy that can make an important impact on a winning football team whether it's the Rams that resign him or another team maybe like the Saints that gets him I think he's going to be a high impact high volume type player this season once he comes back fully healthy in November and has fully recovered for his surgery I think he's going to get back to an Odell Beckham Jr. that we all know and love let's get right into the film breakdown first player from Odell and it just shows he still has the burst if there's any question as to whether or not his burst was taken away from the surgery, it absolutely was not. He still has it. You can see he's up against Mike Hilton. He's one of the best slot corners in the NFL. He just beats him right off rip. Boom. Nice hesitation at the line of scrimmage. Gets right by him. There is nothing wrong with that burst. Nothing wrong. And now that he's had a surgery, an actual correct surgery, where his knee is going to be completely fine once he goes through rehab and recovers, this burst is going to be even, even better. Now it's one thing keeping your burst running in a straight line to the end zone, but he also shows the ability to be able to hesitate, stop, go again. He's right here at the top of the screen. You can see him. He's going to hesitate on a curl. See, he can kind of change his pace. Boom slows down to get the DB to soften up, reaccelerates to fake going deep, catches the DB, comes back in for the curl. That's smart route running, but we know we know he can route run. That's not the point. The point is that's stuff that a guy with a messed up knee shouldn't be able to do. That's a guy that has a wrong knee surgery. His ACL is basically messed up already. He shouldn't be able to do stuff like this. But OBJ is athletically gifted enough that I think he's still going to have his complete burst. Obviously, he's going to need to recover, come back in November, but he already showed this with one messed up ACL. He's perfectly capable of coming in, making an impact, and doing it again. I did two plays about burst, but I still wanted to highlight just how smart of a rut runner he is. That's something that people will never be able to take away from him. He does such a good job of utilizing leverage. There was some talk in the middle of earlier in the season about how maybe he doesn't have it anymore, but still his football IQ is so high. He does such a good job in the slot right here of utilizing leverage against 21, Mike Hilton again. Boom, goes to the right, cuts back to the left to gain leverage. Now Hilton's following him. Hilton is reacting to anything OBJ does because OBJ has beat him off the line. So now, he sells a little bit this way. Sells a little bit this way with a step. Hilton has to follow him because he's already behind. And he cuts back this way. Beats him on the, po on the uh, excuse me, beats him on the deep corner. That's such a smart route. He does a good job of recognizing that he is not at his hip. He is behind him. And so, he controls the route. He controls where Hilton goes, does a step to the middle, cuts back out to the outside, doesn't get the ball, Cooper Cup gets it, and he does Cooper Cup things, but it's just showing that OBJ is still such a smart, smart player. To me, it doesn't matter whether it's the Rams that re-sign him or the Saints because he has that Louisiana connection or whichever team he goes to. Once he fully recovers, I still 100% believe he's going to be able to make an impact he already played on one messed up knee. He can do it again. In fact, once he fully recovers, I wouldn't be surprised if the knee is better than what he was dealing with last season. I am really high on what he's going to do this year. I'm all in on OBJ making an impact on a contender. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like. Subscribe with the notification bell. Leave a comment letting me know your thoughts on OBJ and whether you think he can still be that guy that a lot of people think he is and was as always thanks so much for watching and this was the film room